Tonight, we are heading into one of the busiest travel weeks of the year during a pandemic, and some restaurant workers at Phoenix Sky Harbor Airport are planning to walk out. They say they're not being paid enough, among other issues, and are going on strike. Holly Bach is live at the airport now to explain what exactly this means for travelers. Holly, what can you tell us? Well, Whitney, airport workers are expected to strike beginning tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. So if you are traveling, you may want to get here just a little bit early. This should impact travelers that are departing and arriving from Terminal 3 and 4. There's potential to disrupt services to travelers. During one of the busiest travel weeks of the year, concession workers at Sky Harbor are planning to walk out. Since, um... 20, um, 2017, we haven't gotten a raise at all. Lucia Salinas is a cook at the airport. She says her and her co-workers are asking for better pay and affordable health insurance. We are struggling right now. A spokesperson with HMS Host, the employer of the largest group of Sky Harbor concession workers, says the company is offering a 12% wage increase and increased benefits, including covering 90% of a worker's health care costs, as well as an appreciation bonus of up to $800 per employee. Salinas says it's still not enough. We're working so hard during the pandemic and I just feel like this company is not is not respecting us. HMS host says they are having to bring in employees from other parts of the country. Their managers and supervisors will now be working those positions left open during the strike and sit down restaurants will have a limited menu. We put in more self pay stations. We brought in additional prepackaged fresh food. It's going to impact a lot of people. Starbucks in Terminal 3 and 4 will also be closed tomorrow. Zinn Burger may close too. I would always say strike for a last resort. This Thanksgiving holiday is a good time to strike, but it's very inconvenient for people who don't have anything to do with it. Selena says she understands this strike may worry travelers, but she says it's important to fight for what she believes in. I'm just so sorry about the travelers, right? Because it's not their fault that we're, go we're going through this, but hopefully they understand. Uh, that we are suffering uh, with, with this company. Now, the union says that this strike could last throughout the entire week into next Monday. Sky Harbor says they are aware of the strike. They plan on having their customer service staff out on all of the levels, answering any questions travelers may have, or also directing people to stores that will be open. Reporting live in Sky Harbor, Holly Bach for Arizona's Family.